problem solving can happen where are the methods uh, specifically being highlighted is being a multidisciplinary effort technological growth uh, supporting that uh, a lot of points came in on uh, dual roles where you have to do uh, project execution and development as you grow in a career while having the right kind of a temperament and attitude uh, one or two times we just branched out to find out saying uh, science versus engineering that leads to being a technology and what is uh, where there is a, the fine line has now been grayed out and i don't think you have a line anymore you really don't know where it begins and where it ends that is the nature of uh, interdisciplinary but uh, one fine uh, point that uh, i really want to uh, tell balance is the key i think uh, that definitely came out no matter how uh, how difficult times are whether it is pandemic or not uh, whether it is core project delivery time or not some amount of balance needs to be maintained and that uh, will have clear openings when you do uh, when you have a clear identifying of what is the problem that is needs to be there and how well you can define it and what are the deliverables you understand and later when you realize uh, when you look back on your career say 5 years from now the person who has just joined uh, should feel okay 5 years as actually quite a big ramp and my ramp rate was good but sometime down uh, 15 uh, 15 years you should see that the ramp was fairly similar but uh, i don't see the ramp being on the technology side i'm rather solving people problems i'm solving team problems i'm solving project finance problems and others so uh, i would uh, like to give uh, this session a close uh, saying money is also important the company also looks for money so no matter what technology you build uh, ensure that you bring enough uh, profits on the bottom line that will ensure uh, a lot more support to the technology uh, that these principal uh, or top technologists have spoken to us and let us continue our uh, theoretical training that is here and ensure that the abstract meets the practical world with a very very faint line or rather no faint line and it clearly smoothly transitions out thank you very much uh, i share the floor back to professor vinay for the closing remarks great summary thank you so much thank you javed for uh, making my job easy you have made a very nice summary of the uh, session uh i thank once again uh, all my friends uh, you know dhananjay rashmi uh, you know uh, pritam shri ram javed all of you for uh, jo- yogesh for all of you i am i'm very sure uh, all the uh, uh, you know uh, all of us here you know attending this session had uh, some very interesting perspectives with which you know we could plan the days ahead so before i close uh, thank everybody for uh, joining for, uh, this session once again and i look forward to meeting all of you again in one of the future events uh, i may mention that in the next few weeks we'll have a, a similar session on entrepreneurship because that's another topic that is you know catching fire in the you know in the minds of the students uh, in these times uh, 